here at uh, Jinjin District High School, the last school awards assembly for the season for me. It's been a pleasure to get around the agricultural region and see a lot of students graduating and receiving recognition of their, uh, their work throughout the 2017 school year. Jinjin District High School is uh, the school that I went to for nine years before going away to board at the Mora Residential College. This week the Labor State Government announced a raft of cuts to regional education. The closure of the Mora and Northern Residential Colleges as well as the School of the Year from 2019. In making the announcement to close the Mora Residential College, the Minister for Education uh, simply said that uh, students had other options including attending Yanchim Secondary College from 2018. This is a demonstration of just how out of touch this Minister and this Government is to the needs of regional education in Western Australia. The decision by Labor to uh, cut all of these things from regional education will save them about $16 million a year. Um, to put that into some context, that's about 500 metres of railway line for their Metronet project. Don't be fooled by Labor's message that this is needed to repair the budget. Over the next four years, Labor will add $11.1 billion to, to state debt, largely funding their extravagant election commitments in Perth that were unfunded. This has nothing to do with budget repair. No debt will be paid down by Labor. All they are doing is cutting regional services and infrastructure, like those that are supporting our country kids getting a good education. The Nationals will fight hard against these cuts, but we can't do it without your help. Uh, we need you to contact uh, your local Labor members of Parliament, tell them what you think about these decisions, tell them how it will impact your family, and work with us over the coming year to make sure that these cuts don't come to realisation in 2019.